everybody, it's your friend Cash for Love and welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be continuing ranking all the boss ghosts in Luigi's Mansion series 2 and 3. Not 1, I haven't done that yet. So, let's get into it. <laughs> Okay, so we're on the medium category, and the first one, or the first boss ghost, is going to be the last poltergeist you ever see in Luigi's Mansion 2. This this one was a weird um, boss fight, because um, the fact that he just throws stars at you, and then all of a sudden when you walk into a telescope, you actually appear at a fox, so... There's basically nothing to it, you just have to like flash the light wherever the stars glow and then you find them. Next up we have Chef Soul Flay from Luigi's Mansion 3. Um, he is, a, I think I struggle with him a lot when I first play the game. Well of course a bit of help. But the way he just like starts off with like sm trying to smash Luigi with his um, frying pan was just like kind of scary at the same time but the way you have to like shoot a plunger at him the uh, pan and then take it off him it was a quite difficult task and lastly for the medium category we have the godzilla ghost boss from luigi's mansion 3 this one was like it was obviously a reference to the godzilla movies and the fact that it's just a blue ghost and the fact that we are just making a movie, it was kind of like an adventurous boss fight. And yeah, so basically how it works, whenever he shoots a plasma ball at you, you have to like blow it back. But if it doesn't go, if it still is moving forwards towards you, whip out uh, Guiji and then blow with him as well. And then you will be able to capture ghost next up we have the difficult category and starting off we have the uh, spider boss from luigi's mansion 2 and um, basically this is the first boss ghost ever in the luigi's mansion 2 game and Basically, this is not a boss fight for you that with like arachnophobia. It's the fear of spiders, and um, yeah, when he runs like down the hole and and like crawls up the wall, it's just creepy. <laughs> Next up, we have the. Blue Poltergeist from Luigi's Mansion 2. Um, this guy is just annoying. He had also no purpose of being there. The same for the other two Poltergeists. And um, the way he just throws bombs at you and actually like tries to hurt you with it. He actually tries to like hurt Luigi with bombs. But basically, he will eventually go out of the sand whenever he's like spun around and has his belly down slussing and he will go up there will be other ghosts there as well to try to stop you from killing him instantly and you just have to try to find him and then suck him up and then you defeat him next up we have clem from luigi's mansion 3 um this guy's is just this guy's just the annoying ghosts and also the most annoying level of the Luigi's Mansion 3 game. Because the way he like, his, his attitude, it's like almost creepy in a way. Because like, he tries to push Luigi into spikes and also throws like bombs at you. And by the way, in the beginning, I love the rubber duck. And yeah, he actually tries to, I don't know. But basically what I have to do is, if he throws a bomb and it explodes... He won't get stunned and then you can go up to him and then like suck him up and then shoot him towards the spikes and then he will lie on the ground on the uh, like 
edge of the uh, pole and that's how you can catch him. Okay, next up we have Ugg from Luigi's Mansion 3. This is basically like a caveman ghost you'll see on level level 9. The way he just like possesses this T-Rex bone thing is just like this T-Rex skeleton. It's just creepy in a way. And you just have to like wait for something to fall down from the ceiling. You shoot him. It's like a ball you shoot him with. The third phase, there will be nothing to come up. So you'll have to take Guiji, walk up close to the T-Rex. And then he will try to eat him but get stuck. So you have to shoot the heart of when he's like stuck or something. And then after he tries to like smash you with uh, one of the T-Rex bones when he comes up out of the ground or the T-Rex. He will eventually get stuck with the uh, T-Rex bone in the ground and then you can flash him and then you can defeat him. Next we have Dr. Potter from Luigi's Mansion 3. Um, he's just creepy in a way because the way he's like Venus flytrap or whatever, it's it's basically creepy because it's literally trying to eat him. So what you have to do is try to make the Venus flytrap bite one of the plants in the room and then it'll get stuck then you have to use the chainsaw to cut it off and then you can eventually get Dr. Potter himself. Next we have Nikki, Lindsay and Ginny f from Luigi's Mansion 3. Um, These are just annoying yet again because you have to like memorize who they are and like otherwise they'll bomb you. And so basically you have to like boost up so you can flip the hats that they are in and make sure to remember which one they are in. And then one of them will show and then you can capture them. I don't know why I snapped my fingers. Next up we have Serpsy from Luigi's Mansion 3. Um, she's just creepy. I know I say creepy a lot but I like saying creepy. I don't actually. And basically... She'll turn into this ghost or this sand statue and you have to just like suck away the sand from her face. I know it sounds weird. And then eventually she will shop, stop being shown as a sand monster. She will use like these snakes to both try to smash you and shoot things at you. I don't know what they are. And you have to boost and then flash her and then you can defeat her. And lastly for the difficult section we have Amadeus Wolfgeist from Luigi's Mansion 3. Um, the way he just becomes like a piano and then like tries to smash Luigi in the ground. He's also like one of the main main bosses. Yeah so the way that it works is he will eventually go up on the stage. And he will throw out a bunch of bombs and you have to like catch one of the bombs, shoot it into the um, the trap door thing on the piano. I don't know what it's called. Tell me in the comments. And then it will eventually explode if you hit the um, trap door thing. And then it will explode and then he will be shown and then you can defeat him. And I hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.